Hey YouTube, Smoking Uncle Frank here. Hope you can hear me all right. I got my mic down here next to me, so we'll see. Um, I've been thinking the last few days. I got an email the other day from um, somebody, I guess somebody was uh, involved in the Chicago, because I belong to the Chicago Pipe Show. And they were talking about that um, the hotel, I guess where their people can stay if they go to the Pipe Show. They're refunding people's money for the hotel room because apparently um, the pipe show is not going to be going on this year from from what I can understand so far. I don't know how much of it's true. Um, smoke a little bit of um, canal hood in my, um, in my, um, <laughs> my, my African meerschaum. I picked this up at the last pipe show. Um, Nice pipe, um, but that's not what this is about. Um, I um, been thinking a lot about something that I know everybody else has been thinking about on YouTube and and, and in the world for that matter, and that is um, the coronavirus. Uh, they've updated it now to a uh, worldwide pandemic. Apparently, I thought I'd never have to hear them words in my lifetime, but wow, that, that's something. You know, I don't want to sound, don't turn me off to think that Uncle Frank's going off the deep end and he's nuts or anything, but I've been praying about it. Um, I've been praying to my God, the one that, the, my higher power, who I believe in, and that, 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 and I believe that, that he will get us through this. I mean, if you're looking to the past, I mean, look at the, uh, uh, um, the, the depression people what people went through back then and that was a lot longer than this I, I i hope this doesn't go on as long as that anyway um this is a hard video to make for me because i don't want people to think i'm nuts or anything like that i'm not a religious nut this isn't about religion i don't even go to church but I do believe, I do have faith, and I pray, and I trust in God that God is going to get us through this all. And that's, that's what kind of part of, it, part of it is. You know, I hear stories about people fighting over food in the stores and, and hoarding food and everything. And I kind of understand the, 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 the idea behind some of the hoarding. I mean, some people may be thinking, well, I want to get enough to put in my house and not go out and Stay away from general public until this is all over. Completely understandable. I mean, um, right now, considering it all, um, a lot of people probably don't want to deal with a lot of other people because that ups your chance of catching it yourself. So it's it's a it's a kind of a scary time for everybody. Pipe pipe lighter won't light now though. But you know, we we gotta kind of be, let's be human about it. Not not be uh not not hate and, and fight with people over over a loaf of bread. That's silly. You know, I mean, there's all it's it's not like we're gonna run out of food. I don't think that's ever gonna happen. I mean, the people are gonna the people are gonna still be making it, and life goes on. I think life is gonna go on. Uh, I really do believe that. Um, we've, we've been through, we've been through some hard times in the past and we'll go through hard times in the future probably. And you know what? We'll, we'll, I'm hoping that, that this makes us stronger and not kill each other and fight over it all. Um, this is a short video. I got a, I got, I get, part of what started it was, is I got a message from, uh, some people that I know, a uh, group of guys that, that, that I get together with, and um, we talk, and, and we, uh, the one of the guys just kind of suggested he wanted to start a prayer chain. Okay, fine. All right. I thought that was a little bit, I don't know. I, I wasn't sure what to think about it, but but I think it's a good idea, you know. Um, so he asked us to pass it on to other people, and, and kind of that's what I'm doing here. I'm passing it on, um, you know, pray for our leaders. 
pray for the, the those scientists out there that are that are um, that are working on this. They don't have a vaccine yet. Um, pray for them to have wisdom to figure this thing out because um, ultimately, I believe that really all this here, the whole situation, whether you believe in God or not, my belief. This is just my belief that God is in control and he he's the one that he's the one that's uh that's working this all out. I mean, he he we can't we can't do it without his help. We're not going to make it otherwise if we don't have some kind of faith. Whatever that faith may be. I, it doesn't have to be Jesus Christ or anything like that. Whatever your belief system is, have faith in it. Um love one another. Don't hate each other. Take care of each other. Just be kind to one another. Um, I wasn't really planning on making this long or anything like that because, uh, you know, there's a lot. I had a lot of thoughts on it, but uh, really, basically, it comes down to let's let's all just have a little faith. Um, if if you're if you're a praying person, pray, pray for our leaders and and for 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 those that are working on this uh, to have wisdom that we all get through this without killing each other because it, it, I mean I've seen movies where I mean I hate to think about be like if it was it was something like one of those uh, outbreak movies or whatever uh, I could see people fighting in the streets and killing each other and fighting over cars and whatnot well it's just crazy thoughts So if you think I'm nuts, that's okay. I've been called worse. I'm a crazy old man, I guess. I don't know. Maybe I'm not. Uh, I believe that. I believe that uh, some there is something more powerful out there than just me. I mean, we weren't just uh, created out of some atomic fart. I, I really don't believe that. Um, and I didn't think I was going to talk about this because this is kind of a personal subject, but. You know, I've been through some rough times in my life, and 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 with God and without God. I mean, I in my life, and I, I, not, I like I said, I'm not religious. I don't go to church or anything, but I have faith in, in something other than me. Um, I've been to prison. I I, I spent 16, 16 and a half years almost locked up for a crime that I didn't commit, but. I made it through, um, and I believe that God got me through that situation. And I was bitter about it for a lot of years after that, which which is which leads into the other part of the subject. I um, I drank a lot of it away. I wasted my life. I, I almost killed myself with that with that stuff. Uh, I don't drink now, and that's another miracle in my life. I I've been now sober for almost five years, just because of that. Because of my faith in God, I, I um, turned to him one day and I, I finally just said, you know, I, I really need help. I take this away from me. And, and he did. He, I mean, I couldn't I couldn't do it on my own. I tried doing it on my own. So anyway, before I get all teary eyed here, because uh, this is hard. This is hard for me to talk about talking about my so my my past uh experiences and my addictions and what not. I've been through I've been through some crap, but you know what? In the end I in the end I'm 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 good now. I mean I I've got a nice little house here. It's not it's not a million dollar mansion or anything like that. It's just a, a mobile home trailer, but uh it's mine. You know, and I and I really believe that uh, that is a gift. It's a gift from above or whatever you believe. Um, just take care of each other. Be kind to one another. Smoke along with Frank. Signing out. Bye-bye all.